Hi everyone. I told you that I was gonna bring you another video today. And the first thing that I wanna do is I wanna announce the contest winner as far as how I teach. There were a lot of you that basically said you like it both ways, you wanted it mixed. So what I'm going to do is when I'm doing the detailed teaching, I'm going to do my voice in the background and the diagrams and pictures. But then when I do videos that are more motivational or perspective, then I'm gonna do it on the fly like I am right now. So you'll get a mix of both of them. But when I come, when, I, when it comes to the teaching, I don't wanna do them on the fly like this because I might leave out some very serious details. And I wanna do that. So today we're gonna to talk about our distractions. And I wanna talk about the definition of a distraction. Anything that you focus on does, that does not positively impact you or positively impact your family is a distraction. I'm gonna say that again. Anything that you focus on that does not positively affect you or positively affect your family is a distraction. There are several distractions out there, but I'll talk about a, a few of them. Of course, you know uh, the electronic income reducer and the electronic intellect reducer called the television. Too much television watching going on. And like I say, I'm not telling you not to entertain yourself, but a lot of people spend too much time entertaining. I know people that come home from work, they're in front of the television eating, and then they're in front of the television until the television is watching them. Y'all know what I mean. So we gotta, we gotta stop that because that takes away our focus. And if you're not focused, you're distracted. And if you're, if you're distracted, you're not working on your purpose and your destiny. The next one I wanna talk about is YouTube and TikTok. I don't know if you all know that the Chinese have ownership of TikTok and the, the TikTok that the Chinese watch in China is strictly educational. They don't have all the stuff that we have on TikTok. They've got that stuff going on here to manipulate you and then they're, they're, there's a way that they're getting the information about you. So I, I, I would caution you about being on TikTok. I, I know people that are on TikTok and if you ask them how long they were on TikTok today, they might say 30 minutes or an hour and in reality it's been four hours so that is a big distraction we need to be watching uh what we watch and paying attention to the hours even if you want to watch that stuff put some kind of timer on yourself the next one i want to talk about is sports and i talk about this all the time and I, and I used to use somebody who used to play i don't know who's playing sports this this time but until one of those players whether they be football or basketball or baseball is stroking me the check. My team is going to have to be the Jackson team. We spend too much time talking about my team this and my team that. It's not your team. You're not getting any money out of it. You're screaming to the top of your lungs, throwing stuff around and popcorn and all that, and you're not getting a dime from that. That is a huge distraction. I'm not telling you not to watch sports. I'm telling you to watch the amount of time you watch sports. I know some people during football season who are in front of the television all day Saturday watching the, I think it's college games, and all day Sunday watching the sports, the, the, the pro games. We gotta stop. You got a destiny ahead of you, just like I said. You have a purpose, a vision, and a destiny that you've been called to. And you can't do that if you're sitting there watching sports. And the last one I wanna talk about is my commitment. I don't watch television, but I do, there was, during the dissertation phase, there were certain videos, uh, YouTube videos that I had to watch to help my dissertation. As a matter of fact, my dissertation had something to do with what was going on relational, relationally with YouTube. And there are YouTube content creators that I was watching all the time. But now that that's done, I can't watch that anymore. I continue to watch it, but you know what? It's a distraction from my purpose. So I am making a commitment to only watch the little 15 minute news shows that I watch maybe twice a day on YouTube. I don't have television, so we're not worried about, you know, CNN, you know what the name for that is. All that, I don't watch that because I don't have it. But I will commit, I am committing to make sure that my time is focused on my purpose. My commitment is to make sure that my time is spent doing the things that I am supposed to do to help you guys. So I will uh, continue to have that commitment. This is, this is my last, well it's not. I will be here one more day and I'll be visiting with family. When I get back, I will continue with our plan B for those that want to stay in the United States, but not where they are right now, then I'm gonna give tips on that one. But for now, I want you to remember, anything that you're focused on that does not positively impact you or your family is a distraction. Let's get rid 
of the distractions. This is Sherry Peel Jackson signing out.